What is going on, Fight Fans? This is not clickbait or pretend or trying to make something out of nothing. These are legitimate sources, and it looks like Fight Night Champion 2 has been greenlit, and we are going to get another addition to the Fight Night franchise. This is huge. Without any further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. This is Edward, and you're watching Boxing Fanatico. Okay, so before I even start, I know Fight Night Champions 2 is always used as clickbait for 10 years, nearly 11 years. But this time is not someone posting something saying they want it to come and people are connecting dots. These sources are basically connected to the information that comes out of EA Sports. So we're going to go ahead and jump right into it so you can take a look at what I'm talking about. So, first of all, this is Michael Benson. Michael Benson is a top online boxing editor for top for talksports.com has over 107,000 followers on Twitter and he posted this right here. Full report, uh sorry about that. Full report from VGC News. Uh, which is a video game uh, news outlet who claims that EA have greenlit a new Fight Night game. Now, I have the source up here. This is the source that they have uh, or the, the breakdown of the source. The new game code name Moneyball has entered early development and will resume after UFC 5. This is huge, guys. This is huge. This is the changing of the guard right now in terms of bringing back the, the EA uh, Fight Night series. Electronics Arts, and I'm going to read just the beginning part of this so you guys could uh, understand what they how they got this information. Electronic Arts is set to revive its boxing classic, its classic boxing series, Fight Night, in the near future. Development sources have said, according to people with knowledge of EA Sports, labels plans the new fight night which is currently codenamed moneyball has been greenlit and entered early development however the series first installment in decade in a decade is still is still likely several years from release this is an important thing because if people who are just impatient about ESBC are jumping up and down for joy, you are 100% more likely to get ESBC first before this comes out. But at least this creates competition in the marketplace. And that is something that's incredibly important so that no one becomes stale. NBA 2K was thriving when they had to fend off EA uh, NBA Live. And now that it's the head honcho, they've kind of relaxed and, you know, done whatever they wanted to do with the exception of maybe the last release. A lot of people like it, but for years they were kind of laxed and it's because there's really no competition in the marketplace. So this will create future competition, but don't think that this means that they're coming out before ESBC. It's an early development while ESBC is way past early development uh this is due to Can ea canada's decision to temporarily pause its core development in order to prioritize the next ea sports ufc game which is planned for late next year in a studio wide email seen by vgc uh, who's reporting on this ea canada told staff that it is that its focus would be on EA Sports UFC 5 for the foreseeable future. The email explained that strong marketplace competition had made it challenging to staff up for Fight Night, which was intended to enter production alongside UFC, and that it did not want to split its senior creatives between two fighting game projects. Thus, the decision has been made to pause the game's development for the time being to ensure that UFC 5 will be delivered at high quality. Quality, the email reads we were very excited about UFC 5 and we want to eliminate the split focus that several num members of our leadership team have had over the past while uh, have had over the past while so we can 
have had over the past while so we can solely focus on delivering migration and ufc 5 at high quality not much is currently known about the new boxing game but it's understood that ea sees the revival as a means of reasserting itself in the fighting game market as for commentary on the story an electronic art spokesperson points it to the company's policy of not responding to rumors and speculation now you would think that this is just rumors and speculation and it's just whatever no these are people uh with vgc connected to these emails talking about how fight night is supposed to start but they paused it so that they can make sure that ufc 5 has high quality now ufc 5 is scheduled to release late next year so that means that this project is paused until late next year and then they will commence and usually because it's in early stages a project of that magnitude would take roughly roughly if we're going to be generous to try to get it out as quickly as possible will take about three years so we're looking at four years out until we get fight night champions too so if you're super excited and think that this means that well there you go esbc you just took way too long to give us information now look what's gonna happen we're gonna be playing fight night you're more than likely it's like a 99.9999 eight seven eight two percent chance that you are going to be playing esbc way before you play fight night champions 2 but for esbc 2 this is going to be a direct competitor because i believe esbc will probably be uh, esbc for about three to four years and then they're going to depending on the success of the game which i, I have a feeling is going to be successful they will have a uh esbc2 rollout and esbc2 will be fighting directly with fight night champions 2 or whatever the name is going to be called right now it is code name moneyball so i am very excited about this because i do like competition now i do understand that they lean towards that arcade sim aspect of boxing but with the excitement that they have seen with esbc which is probably the thing that made them green like this with that excitement are they looking to lean in more to the simulation aspect of boxing and if they do will this present a problem for esbc if they're going like they don't even want to split the teams they want them to work 100 in this and they have been able to make good quality products in the past i'm not a super fan of fight night champion but i am a very strong uh fan of fight night round uh three and uh fight night uh 2004 so they have the the years of experience to kind of figure out how to wiggle their way into making something that's good as long as they lean more into the simulation and not just sim arcade i think with esbc they may actually be doing just that that is a possibility but they have a lot of time to sit back relax see the reception of fight night of esbc and then work off of that um and that's going to be an advantage to them but esbc i think they're ready and uh they're willing to combat uh and this competition can only help the consumer the more the merrier and you can bet yourself that i will be buying uh fight night champions 2 if it ever comes out but right now i'm still more excited for esbc considering the fact that we're going to be getting it earlier and i know that they lean into the simulation aspect and that's something that right now we are in the dark when it comes to fight night champions hopefully they do uh but we don't know and their last project fight night champions 2 didn't do that so we're gonna have to wait and see what do you guys think about this this is breaking news we just got this information today but it is phenomenal it is phenomenal to see that they have green lit fight night champions revival after 10 years and i think the excitement that we have generated behind esbc is a huge reason why this revival has been given the green light this is Edward from Oxford Fanatico, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.